Have you ever imagined being alive even after death? Well, a few animals are fortunate enough to experience life even after death. Humans adore immortality, yet we can never achieve it. A few of the animals have been living their dreams, from totally frozen bodies, chopped off body parts, to surviving nuclear bombs. Let's look at the top 20 animals that can live after death. Cockroaches It shouldn't be a surprise when these tiny little bugs top this list. Cockroaches are infamous for their tenacity and thought to be the most unlikely survivors of a nuclear war. Some claim they can live without their heads. Cockroaches can live without their heads for weeks. When decapitated, they don't bleed like humans. Courtesy of their open circulatory system, their wound naturally closes due to clotting. Headless cockroaches breathe through little holes located on their bodies called spiracles, but may eventually die of starvation. Flatworms An old wise saying of how earthworms reproduce say if you cut it in half, two earthworms are produced. Substitute earthworms with flatworms, and this theory becomes true. Flatworms are regeneration masters. After amputation, they rebuild body parts. If one is cut into half, the head portion grows a tail, and the tail portion grows a head. Cut it into 20 pieces, and 20 new worms are created similar to the original. University scientists have exploited this and created a colony of over 20,000 worms. And guess what? They're all from one original whose organs do not appear to age. Turtles. The hearts of fish, mammals, reptiles, and birds have like their pacemaker cells. They tick over when their brainstem signals aren't coming through, ensuring the heart functions for a while while the brain doesn't. These animals that can live even after death die for how long? Well, try 5,000 hours for the loggerhead sea turtle. And they survive that long on oxygen intake from the water through their skin. While their bodies produce energy without oxygen, their hearts have fuel sacs, and they won't give up until it's used up. Octopus have you seen online videos of octopus moving after being chopped off? In certain countries, eating a fresh octopus is a deadly delicacy. The octopus arms continue moving and get stuck in one's throat, resulting in a bad day. The reason for their mobility after being chopped off is because their nervous system is unique and two-thirds of their nerve cells are in the tentacles. Hence, they continue being responsive to stimuli even if they are not connected to the brain. Researchers at St. George's University in London also researched this phenomenon. Salamander You will be hard-pressed to include salamander on your list of animals that can live after death. It's synonymous to long life and immortality, and magicians believe it is ability to regenerate its body parts is paranormal. Salamanders have the uncanny ability to regenerate any chop part of their body, courtesy of a special protein that replicates cells. The regrown parts can function the same or better than the original parts. A small amount of this protein is found in humans and helps in wound healing. Can we also regenerate several limbs? Well, scientists are still studying that. Frogs. This to you may sound like an insane animal, the frog. It's been discovered that frogs move even with their brains dead, to be precise, with their brain missing. This experiment was reported when scientists discovered reports of headless animals continuously moving, and it was very impressive. But what the hell happens when you remove the frog's brain and leave the body intact? Well, thanks to the scientist David Ferrerial, a brainless frog behaves similar to one with brains it can swim and turn in different directions. Bees. This might sound like a cop-out to you. No, bees die and stay dead. However, these creatures can live after death appear on its list because even though bees die, they can still sting you. Of course, not the way you think. Dead bees don't fly to sting you, but long after it's dead, the stinging part and the venom delivery system stays active. When it stings, the sting detaches from its body and embeds into the victim's body. A bee's action is controlled by involuntary impulses, so if you thought you were safe picking up a dead bee, think again. Flies David Blaine brings dead flies to life, yes, but it's not because he has supernatural powers. 
Flies can survive freezing temperatures and even go into some kind of suspended animation. This ability to withstand freezing temperatures is not why the humble fly makes it on the list. After decapitation, female flies can live for several days. Such beheaded females can also assume upright stands, and they can do and engage in complex actions like lying and under duress walking. Amazingly, incapacitated females can be courted. Oh yes, chop off the female fly's head and nothing changes really. Wolf Eel Unlike its name, wolf eel is actually a fish, not an eel. Because of its elongated shape, this wolfish species living in the northern Pacific is always mistaken to be an eel. Its head can bite even if you cut it from its body. The reason for its ability to bite after decapitation is because it's a cold water species animal that lives in ice. The cold temperature allows tissues like brain, nerves, and muscle to survive longer before dying of lack of oxygen. Therefore, decapitation doesn't harm the reflex from the brain to the mouth. Scorpions. The longest time humans can go without eating is a month on average, but scorpions can slow down their metabolism to the point of surviving on a single insect for an entire year. They're masters of adapting, perhaps that's why they do survive hundreds of millions of years. They can live in most temperatures and environments. In fact, a scorpion was even frozen before and came back to life walking away as nothing had ever happened and without any injuries. This must be one of the animals that live in ice. The lungfish. Humans need daily food and water to survive, unlike some amazing animals that live after death. The lungfish inhabits Africa, South America, and Australia. It lives in mucky margins of swamps and rivers, and sometimes during droughts, it can go for long years without food and water. During this time, the lungfish temporarily shuts the systems and remains in suspended animation. It is a true underground survivalist. Scientists are studying the animal with hopes of advancing in medicine and space travel. Jellyfish. Could it be because of this jellyfish that people still search for the mythical fountain of youth? This jellyfish is an immortal animal. It has its way of living young forever. Medusa are magical animals with complex patterns that look like alien, and only a few reach immortality. They reverse completely to an immature state after reproduction. They also keep themselves from dying, and when they get injured, they undergo a reverse aging process that brings them back to their polyp stage, starting all over again with younger cells. If only we could do that. The tardigrade. Also known as the water bear, these microscopic strange animals from the depths of the ocean can survive in temperatures as low as minus 20 degrees for decades and as high as 150 degrees Celsius and come out alive. They can endure volcanic thermal burns at the bottom of the ocean and survive in space radiations as well. This cute little animal truly lasts us all. While you and I will be long gone, the species to this seemingly immortal and most powerful animal on Earth will continue to live somewhere in the universe. Siberian permafrost worms. Found in Siberia are these nematodes, which are such a pro in not kicking the bucket. The permafrost nematodes were found frozen over 42,000 years ago. They are similar to worms, but much smaller. These craziest animals that live after death are only one millimeter in length and can live almost a mile below the surface. When scientists towed out the worms, they came back to life and started moving around and even resuming normal eating. Have these worms been waiting for millenniums just to wake up and make the appearance again? The alligator. Alligators enjoy living in tropical regions, but how do these guys with a deadly bite survive for long in the winter months when snow hits without calling? While animals like bears go into hibernation, alligators have their strategy. At just the right moment before water freezes, they stick out their snouts out of the water, and the water freezes around them as they breathe up in the air with their noses. They get into a state of bermination. As the temperature drops, they get more lethargic to save up energy until when winter is over, and they resume a normal life. Snakes. But first, do us a favor. Click that like button to inspire us. Subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell and you won't miss any interesting videos. Done then? Let's go. Our best pick, terrifying animals, ferocious, it can kill you even with its head chopped off. People react differently when they encounter highly venomous snakes, running away, throwing things, or kill it. 
Chopping off their heads may be a peaceful way to avoid being bitten, but the truth is that's not the case. A snake's head, a vessel for its fangs and deadly poisons sacs, still can bite you, delivering deadly venom when the detached from the body. It detects threats with heat sensitive pits on both sides of its face hours after its death, defending itself zombie style. Chickens Stop running around like a headless chicken. Ask any farmer and they will tell you this is true. These amazing animals can still run around with their heads cut off, not because they are zombies, but because of human error. Chicken's central nervous system is very different from humans, and some basic body functions are controlled by certain brain parts. So if a butcher chops its head too high, it's just the forebrain. He misses the jugular, so the chicken can move and breathe like one special chicken that survived 18 months without its head. Ocean Quahog the ocean quahog is a species of edible clam native to northern Atlantic Ocean. This insane animal is part of a delicacy in most of the countries they live. They can live much longer than expected. When scientists actually killed one in Iceland, they studied it inside and noticed it was 507 years old. This animal can live this long because unlike other animals whose oxygen molecules react with cell membranes and produce molecules that damage cells, its cell membranes have resistance to this oxidative stress and do not deteriorate at all, allowing them to live far beyond other creatures and even after death. Which of these animals fascinated you the most? Have you encountered these types of animals before? Let us know in the comment section below. Like always, if you enjoyed it, be sure to give us a big thumbs up and leave us some love in the comment section. To keep up to date with all of our awesome videos, be sure to hit subscribe and turn your notifications on to never miss a thing. Until next time, do take care of yourself.